Yes? Hello? You're wanted in the teacher's lounge immediately. <laughs> Look! I redecorated the principal's office. Funny, right? Not bad. If you keep it up, maybe you can be my friend. <laughs> oh, yeah! Why did you do that, dear? Are you upset? Well done, Cindy. You're on the right track. <laughs> Something wrong, sweetie? <sighs> Mom! Well, if there's a problem... Please tell me! You wouldn't understand. Maybe you... Is it because you had a big argument with your boyfriend? Come on! Don't worry, Talk you... to me! Oh. I remember being your age. I've been befuddled by my fair share of silver-tongued elven princes. Uh, meanwhile, no one minds ignoring an ogre. No, honey. <laughs> Now's not the time. You're always trying to change the subject and talk about yourself. Well, when am I going to meet this adorable boy? Is this a nightmare, or did you actually just say that? Well, that mystery's solved. I know a broken heart when I see one. We should just let we her... We need to help her somehow. Mm. If only we could go see what's been happening at school. But Willow, you can't. You're an adult. <laughs> I have some news. Your history teacher had to take a trip up north. <laughs> Don't worry, we found a sub, Ms. Willow. Our lives are over. What if she tries to use magic? What if all our friends find out that she's our mom? We're doomed! <laughs> Hello. Hi, I'm Tamara. Welcome to our school. Thanks, Tamara. Yeah, yeah welcome, welcome to, to our school. school. Hey, Mom, what do you think you're doing? Just trying to understand a few things I wouldn't understand. Uh, <laughs> uh, uh, what's up, Cindy? Uh, Today we're going to be learning about... Ah! War in the Middle Ages. Perfect. I know it all by heart. Once upon a time, there was an elf. Whoa. His name was Gerard, and he was fearless. He dreamed of marrying the most mysterious princess in the realm. But to win her heart, he would have to challenge and defeat Murdoch the Terrible. The duel lasted for 11 days and 12 nights. The two adversaries destroyed everything in their path. This went on for so long that Merlin sent a dragon to stop them. The dragon tried to separate them with his flames. But he failed and the battle continued. Ooh, she'll pay for that one. Flash forward several months. Murdoch, exhausted, tripped over a mushroom, and Gerard swooped in to deal the final blow. Then he finally got to meet and marry his princess. <coughs> doesn't have one. Now go away. Her whole look is so weird. And what's with the creepy smile? I bet you her family's a major freak show. <laughs> <laughs> we have got to get rid of her. Uh, oh, totally. Let's take her down. Today! If you really want to be my friend, you'll promise to humiliate that pathetic teacher. Oh, what? Uh, for sure. <laughs> yeah! One for all. And, and all for, for Tamara. Tamara. And all for Tamara. Come on, girls, let's go. Uh. I heard that you've been using some very advanced technology to present information in your history lessons. <laughs> the rate things are going, we'll all be replaced by robots. Robots, huh? Hmm, I think I've got it. Ha! <laughs> Doubling your allowance. 
Lois, how does that sound? <laughs> what? Where's the vending machine? Hi, Jojo. I mean, hello there, young man. Hmm. Hey, you're Tom's mom, aren't you? What are you <laughs> talking about, troll? Why don't you go play in your room? Leave now! <gasps> Hi, how's your day, sweetie? Uh, student? <laughs> Good, see you, Mom! Uh, ma'am! <laughs> Wait a sec. Uh, Tom, Tom goes go see Jojo. Jojo. He's right over there. <laughs> You see how this rope is pulled tight? When she comes to the door, she'll trip and go flying into that cart in front of everyone. <laughs> Not bad. There she is. Way to go, Cindy. Let's go, girls. You have ordered one hot chocolate. Oh, Mom. You're making my life way harder, you know? Please get out of here. Seriously. You've Gotta listen to me, okay? You seem very anxious. I'm worried. What's going on, Cindy? Is it that Kevin? I've seen the way you lovebirds look at each other. <laughs> Kevin, ew! <laughs> How could you ever think that Kevin is my boyfriend? <laughs> <laughs> now, now, children, you shouldn't make fun of this young lady for being in love with Kevin. Haven't you heard of that old expression, the heart wants what it wants? <laughs> <laughs> what now? Your job isn't done. Don't worry, I've got a plan. This is your last chance. I want Miss Willow to be so embarrassed that she leaves and never comes back. <laughs> Cindy! Cindy! <sighs> We're in big trouble! Tamara's gonna humiliate Mom! We gotta stop her! Hey, how come you have the wand? Well, you see, I needed to prank Mom, and I did. No way! <laughs> <laughs> Everyone's so giggly today. Did somebody tell a good joke? What's happening here? I'm just talking to the students. It's important to form a bond. I hired a teacher, not a clown! A clown? You really did that to her? This isn't a circus, it's a school. We have an image to uphold. Why'd you have to steal her magic wand? And why'd you want to embarrass Mom? Ugh, let's just say it's really complicated. Okay, but I hope you have a plan to get out of this pickle. Hmm. <laughs> Sorry, but you wouldn't stop bugging me. Regardless, I'd never try that with my mom. Well, I would never spy on my daughter's social life if I had one, and I'm nobody's girlfriend, especially not Kevin's. Miss Willow, <gasps> please pack up your special effects equipment and leave the premises immediately. You're fired, you hear me? <laughs> What a shame. If this continues, we can say goodbye to edible food. Mother, I shouldn't have humiliated you today. It was wrong. 
Cindy, I shouldn't have pretended to be your history teacher. It was wrong. I, I love, love you. you. Truly, I'm, I'm sorry. No. Oh. I'm, I'm sorry. sorry. You better stop or I'm going to throw up. Come on. I'm, I'm sorry, Felicia. Let go of me. I forgive you. I forgive you, too. Tamara, do you think the monsters are still out there? If you were really my friend, you'd go look for me. Would someone please tell me why a newlywed couple would spend their honeymoon in a creepy deserted hotel with no electricity? You're ruining the movie! I think the scriptwriter and director are responsible for that, Tom. singing competition, sweetheart. This afternoon, and I want you all there. <laughs> See everyone, except you. Later. Not fair. I don't get to go anywhere. I always end up alone. Look on the bright side. At least you don't have to suffer the Dying Caps concert. Oh, now, come on, Ferocia. She's not that bad. Gregor, when was the last time you were a teenage girl? Well, actually, uh... Are you really going to let your daughter on stage to make a complete and utter fool of herself? I shouldn't interfere. Mom, I think this is one of those situations when you really should. Hmm. Hmm. I'd want to give that beard a bit of a wash. What are you doing here? I'll be good. You won't notice I'm here, I promise. Give all the people a wave. 
<laughs> I'm Tom the Ventriloquist, and this is my talking toad, His Highness! Talking toad, ventriloquist. Uh, the worst thing about being a ventriloquist dummy is being told what to do. <laughs> On that note, good night. What? I thought it was a good night. <laughs> Okay. Good news! I've ended you in talent trap! No way! <clears throat> no way. Ah. Can I turn that offer down? <laughs> hey, Cindy, I heard what happened to you. It's terrible. <laughs> I think it's so brave of you to show your face in school. Hey, Cindy. Hey, Shirley. Hey, Hank. <laughs> Cindy, are you doing anything on Saturday night? Mm -hmm. No, you aren't, or no, you don't want to come to the cinema. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. I'll go. Thanks, Shirley. I'll call you. Get ready. Okay, now don't move. Testing one, two, three. I don't understand. My magic is having no effect. Are you tired of your talents going unnoticed? Would you like a shot of fame? Then hurry up and end your talent trap. A chance for us to trap your talent. And the winner gets a kiss from our beautiful Opal. <laughs> what? You never said the winning act gets a kiss from Opal, the princess of pop. This is the opportunity I've been waiting for. <laughs> A kiss from a princess could turn me back into a prince. I'm not sure she's a real princess. We have to win. And this means practice. It's the opportunity of a lifetime. Why do I feel like I'm going to regret this? <laughs> Did you know that in a recent survey, the number one reason for acts failing on Talent Trap was... Having a toad as a partner? No. Lack of experience performing in front of a real audience. And I've got just the remedy. I've booked loads and loads of gigs for us. We'll be the talk of the town. Oh, Broadway, here I come. I think this will work. Let's hope so. From throat to tongue, it's all gone wrong, so change the tune for a different song. <coughs> oh, let's try again. Uh, chuka kabuka panache and moustache, a dash and a splash. Oh, a google, a spoogle, a bundle, a rundle, a sprinkle of spider leg tea. Two new messages. Soggy slippers and rubber dippers, flippers and skippers, toads and Mom! Mom! Did you prefer the pigeon? <laughs> what are you doing? Good. You're awake. Time.
time to work on our act. Work on our act? The audience loves us. The audience loves me. I'm carrying you. La, 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 la. <sighs> oh, make me laugh. <laughs> We're in more trouble than I thought. Anyway, I can't. I'm doing stuff with Jojo today. After we win Talent Trap, there will be plenty of time for you to play with Jojo. Besides, we only have 15 more practices scheduled between now and the contest! The contest! The contest! Sleep well, your highness. All right, partner. We'll try again tomorrow. So, I'll go to the cinema with Hank tonight, and I'll put in a good word for you. Okay? No! Shirley, come here for a second. I'll be right back. <laughs> hey, Shirley. This is Mr. Pleasant, Shirley's very, very angry father. Uh, yeah? Uh... <laughs> hey, Cindy. You're looking better, aren't you? I'm all right. Let's go for a walk. Hello? Hello? I'm sick of it! Sick of it! Sick of it! I quit! <gasps> what am I hearing? You're slacking off? I'm sick and tired of being ridiculous! You wouldn't abandon your oldest friend, would you? <gasps> You wouldn't leave me all alone in this froggy body, would you? All right, you win. I'll do it. Ah, that's my boy. One, two, one, two, one, two, one, two. One, two, one, two, one, two. It's good for your voice. One, two. One, two. <laughs> and that's, that's what, what friends, friends are, are for. for. Jazz hands. Huh? In the name of... Can't you get anything right? <laughs> <laughs> Watch it, Toad. I swear, ever since his invisible dog Barkey ran away, he just can't do things right. <laughs> well, at least I'm not afraid of broccoli. You, you said you'd never tell. Tom sleeps with a nightlight on. <laughs> his Highness cries at commercials for fabric softener. <laughs> Once, Tom got mistaken for a garden gnome. I've got news for you! Oh, oh yeah? I'm the ventriloquist, and I don't uh. need you. to get extra hankies for the cry bit. Okay. Don't even think about turning around, buddy. Mr. Pleasant? I see that you haven't followed my advice. So you listen to me carefully. If you don't want to be watching movies to some sort of hospital eye straw, I suggest you leave now. I think that girl Cindy's more your type. I already tried to ask her out. She said no. Try harder. <laughs> now go! <laughs> Hank? Hank? Ha 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 ha. What's going on in there? Who is with you? 
Let's be in! Go away! His Highness, Tom has a new frog now. You are so dismissed. Well, I'm not going to stand for this. Look! A snake! A worm? Hey, look at this! I think you've got some groveling to do. Okay, but it's going to cost you... What? A hug. But you're a toad. I'm very slimy. Mm -hmm. Oh, good to have you back. Now it's time to get serious. We have got to win this competition. And I can't help feeling that the ventriloquism act alone just isn't enough. We need to find something unique. Do you know what I'd do if I was you? What? what? I'd write a letter of apology to all the unfortunate people who have to sit through your act. You are that boring. Even Cindy with a deep voice is more entertaining. <laughs> what you up to, guys? Cindy, how would you like to help us win Talent Trap? Hmm, Mandragora and Pistachio, Saffron and Carpaccio. Oh, that won't work. Oh, I don't know, maybe something in the Latin. Hmm. Good book, dear. We really don't want to miss the big show. I haven't found the right spell to cure Cindy. Oh, no time for that. We have to go. Oh! Welcome, Welcome to, to Talent, Talent Trap. <laughs> and now, let's have a look at our previous candidates. Fantastic! Please welcome onto the stage Tom and his talking toad! Wait, wait, wait! We forgot something! What? Why, a song performed by the most extraordinary voice in the world! <laughs> will find her voice so mm -hmm. the dancer can dance for Joyce. No! No way! I'm a girl with a pretty voice! It's back! I'm me! Cindy, I beg of you not to continue! I can do this! We're finished! I have to say goodbye to the magical kiss. I'm a teen! looks really fake. And, and that, that dance, dance routine, routine was so 1940s. One word, one syllable, and dreadful. My only regret is I don't have more thumbs to put down. Lose the toad, Tom. And Cindy, consider miming. Lots of pop stars do it. Next! Um, what now? This is awkward. 
But is there any chance that the Princess of Pop could pop up here and give me a kiss on the cheek? <laughs> <laughs> Just a, just a small kiss! I only kiss winners! Fantastic! I was afraid you'd say that. People just weren't ready for your music, Cindy. It's rare that true artists are recognized in their own time. Thanks, Dad. Don't worry, I'll never interfere again. Actually, there's kind of a dancing competition next week. Mm. <laughs> <laughs> I guess you're looking for my daughter. No, sir! No, I'm not! <laughs> Do you think His Highness is okay? He's fine. He's no longer complaining, and now he has someone of his own kind to hang out with. Oh, never mind what these stupid judges said. I think you're very, very talented. Well, I may not have got to kiss the princess, but at least I found you. What else do you think about me? Eh, uh, you're green. <laughs> you know me so well. Is it true you cried commercials for fabric softener? Shh! Don't say a word, darling. Let this beautiful summer night carry on. Oh. <laughs> 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 <laughs>